Let's get to the video. These are all the ingredients you would need to make this recipe. All right, guys, I have chopped up um, a little bit of onion and some green peppers. Um, I like green peppers, so I just added the green peppers in it. Um, it wasn't in her recipe, but I just added them. I love the taste of peppers. Um, it's amazing. So, yeah. All right, guys. See you soon. All right, guys. So, now I am um, just grounding the meat. Onion powder. Black pepper. Adobo. to mix all that in I need something different because this is not working <laughs> the chopped onions and the chopped green peppers um, with the beef that's cooking so you're just gonna get that all up in there um, with those good flavors I'll show you how that looks right now so everything everything is just cooking cooking away it smells really good All right, so once you put the cheddar cheese into the hamburger meat with the onions um, and peppers, optional, this is how it should look right now. Then you add your cheese, your American yellow cheese. A lot of it. Make it nice and cheesy. And then you're gonna cut 
cover it, cover it up. So it all can melt. All right, and then you cover it. I have it on, that's what I have it on, about right there. Um, for a while till all the cheese melt. So yeah, it looks good. I'm excited to try it. When I saw um, my full figured life try it, whoo, my tongue was watering. So I'm excited to try this. All right, this is how it looks with the cheese melted. And I did go ahead and put a little mayo on my bread. Here's the finished product, guys. This sandwich uh, looked so delicious and yummy and juicy. And I couldn't wait to take a bite into my sandwich. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh Finished product, guys. I am ready to jump in. I have my New York City chopped cheese. I'm ready to taste it. So, guys, thank you for watching. And subscribe, guys.